What's up, everybody? It's a rainy day here in southern Arizona. What's up? I'm Ben, and that is rainy over there. It's a rainy day. <laughs> I already introduced myself. Oh, yeah, you did. And this is the Journals of Awakening. Welcome in, everybody. Today, we're coming at you with a really hot topic. Definitely. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's going to blow it's your It's going to turn heads. Huh? It's going to turn heads. It's supposed to snow tonight. <laughs> We literally don't the know weather. what we're talking about. Yeah, the okay. weather, you, like a dad would. How's the, how's the weather in your guys' part of the world, huh? Ours is sleet right now. No, it's not. It's sleet. He wants it so badly to snow that it's he's sleet. calling He's calling this rain sleet. <laughs> it's literally rain. <laughs> we just took like a 30-minute drive on the highway, and my car lifted off the ground a couple times. That was fun. Uh, he did it on purpose. I did. I would never do. I would never fly a car on purpose. You literally drove into a puddle. I didn't do that on purpose. Oh, on the way home. Like, no, like but also the, like on the dips on the highway. You no, could have gone in the that. middle. No, I didn't do that. He didn't do that. Apparently, I was controlling the car safely. I, I, if I had to go through a puddle, it's because I was already going fifty-five miles. He thought an he hour. was a NASCAR driver and that nothing could hurt him, <laughs> but that's not the I case. I gripped the steering wheel real tight when I hit puddles. Oh, good. Yeah. That's not going to fix it either. <laughs> it's the bald, bald tires, y'all. Bald tires. I think that anybody could have hydroplaned right there. Yeah, definitely. There's a bridge area between our towns, and it is treacherous. And it's like that every year. Yeah, yeah. And they never fix it. They just put up cones around it. Man, I just I legit don't have a topic. I'm talking about something. Oh, okay. Fox I'm sorry. Border Patrol. No, <laughs> I was like, I want to talk about something, like, serious, like... Yeah, well, it doesn't always have to be serious. Yeah, but nobody's going to listen to us just talk about our drive. It's not true. Are you guys going to listen to us talk about our drive? <laughs> no, hell no. Hey, but we're working on some rain ASMR for you guys right now. Yeah, we got to kill a good long time. It's going to be so nice. It is really... It's... Kill, killing... What do you mean, kill a long time? What are you talking about? I, well, I wasn't finished with my thought. Oh, you stopped talking and stared at me. So I yeah, because you were looking, you were like trying to figure out. No, we're gonna kill a good long time with recording ASMR. Like we're gonna play Fortnite and get some food and just kind of forget my phones outside in the How rain. Long that's gonna take to upload. Yeah, like the whole day. <laughs> Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, but it needs to be like at least 20, 25, 30 minutes. Yeah, it takes... People uh, listen to ASMR for like 30 minutes. I'm going to upload it to my YouTube channel. And mine. And yours. (laughs) No, I can't. It was my idea. It's only going on Ben's. It was Ben's idea. It's just she has a a cell phone and it's an iPhone, so it's got a good camera. Imagine, imagine, it's like a game camera and like a cat wanders through the yard right in front of the camera. Like a stray? Yeah, like that'd be sick. I want to set up a game camera so bad. I want to know what's coming into our our yard every night. Well, there's tons of them out there. They're really affordable. It's just a matter of, is that a necessity? Fuck yeah. (laughs) It would be purely for my pleasure. And my pleasure is always a necessity. There you go. That's what she wants for Christmas, everybody. A game camera. I want a game camera. A good one. A shitty one that blurs the animals and makes their eyes look horrendous. Well, you gotta remember most of the time they're in action and it's not an iPhone. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> you know, and it's waterproof and it's tied to a tree, you know. Fog, I would I would love stuff. to take pictures of wildlife. <laughs> that sounds so dangerous. I know. <laughs> I know we it do does. That all the time. Every time we see wildlife. No, I know, it. but I my favorite thing is to take pictures of the cats, right? They're just so photogenic. The strays? No, or, oh, ours? yeah, oh, okay. but I could take photos of, like, real-life wildlife. Yep. I never thought about that, you know? Uh, doing it for, like, magazines and shit. Right. Like, that's a real thing. That is a real thing. Yeah, My and I just... My mom's husband does that. Used to. He's on magazines, hunting magazines. No, I know, but I would love to take, like, you know the, like, the elephant documentary <laughs> we watched? I'd love yeah. to go to Africa and take pictures of elephants with my camera. That's dangerous as fuck. But it's exhilarating and no, fun. that's not fun. That thing will kill you. <clears throat> no, it won't. How not... is that fun? You want to stand in front of a 10,000 pound beast that can fucking murder you. They're not. They don't. Yes, they do. I no, heard they... they're really, really violent. That's what I heard. Elephants? Elephants. No. You're thinking of hippos. And hippos. <laughs> Elephants are not violent at all whatsoever. I have tickled the bottom of an elephant's foot. Hey, man, if they live at the zoo, that don't count. It I definitely don't count. Whatever. Yeah. Elephants are not violent. I'm about to look it up because... 
Just type in our elephants violent. Seriously, just like that. Yeah, okay. Let me figure out how to spell the word elephant. E L E P H A N. No, I don't need your help. It's right here on Google. Yeah? Yeah, just click this one and I erase the word mammals. <laughs> and then I write, uh, what was it? Violent. V. No, stop, stop. Aggressive? Stop. Dangerous. I know how to spell dangerous, you douchebag. Okay. <laughs> All right, what's it say? Elephants are the strongest and largest land mammals on Earth and can be very dangerous and aggressive towards humans, you motherfucker. The threat that elephants pose is highly dependent on sex, circumstances, and environment. Yeah, so if they're in a wild environment, they're not going to get violent. But they're talking about, like... No, they're saying they're safe if they're at the zoo. If they're in the wild, you'll... No, die. that's not true, because they filmed the movie Elephants. See? Look at this kid. Touching an elephant? Look at this guy being murdered by an elephant. <laughs> That's the wild? That's the zoo. What? No. <laughs> most it's really of, simple. I don't know most of the talking. elephants that mangle people are because they were involved in, like, show acts and went crazy. Or were, like, tortured. Wouldn't you mangle a human that kept you in a cage? Yeah, I but would too. but not if the human's going into their territory. Then they know that they hold the floor. You know, it's a totally different amount of confidence. They can be ain't dangerous if mm. any animal can be dangerous. This is a great subject, and I completely disagree. Type in, are dangerous. Type in, are horses dangerous? Why? Because it's going to prove to you the okay. same All thing. Right, fine. Fine. Don't even start spelling this shit. H? Shut up. <laughs> Anyone who considers horseback riding, whether a single vacation trail ride or lifetime hobby, must acknowledge that horses are a half-ton animal and the ability to cause tremendous harm. The three most common causes of injury associated with horse riding are falling off, being kicked, and, or, and being bitten. Yeah, I mean... That, it doesn't say anything about their dangerous to humans. That's being a dumb fucking human putting it, your hand in their mouth, standing behind so it, So type in, type falling in, off. That's a human fault. But elephants aren't going to harm a person like they're not going to charge they're just harmful because they're big and shit wild horses can attack humans but they rarely do okay say that about elephants. google uh <laughs> uh will how often do elephants attack humans oh my gosh okay you, you keep them entertained okay i'm better. keeping y'all entertained because as far as i know elephants are very docile creatures and they're very chill and I even saw it in the Jungle Book. That, that's a lot. That's a cartoon. <laughs> it's like a rainy fact. I know. Yeah. So we're going to look this up. And we're going to... What are you trying to search hey. for? I'm just trying to help you. You got me Googling shit. And you gave me like 12 words that I can't spell. So I'm trying to fucking figure it out before you call me out and try to spell it out loud. Okay, I'm Stop. sorry. Do you want me to repeat no. the sentence? Nope. All right, Ben's brain doesn't work like no, mine. No, it's fucking over cumbers. She's got me googling during a podcast. This Be is absolutely bogus. I'm shutting my computer. You did no, not. No, it's in the podcast apart. So you did not just say that subject. bogus. I did say bogus. So we're gonna just stop the conversation because I'm getting way overwhelmed with that shit. Yes, blood, uh, uh, elephants are dangerous. If you don't think so, go pet an elephant and die. I and fucking I, will. I'm just say. Just so I can say, I told you so. I fucking will. You go ahead. Legit. By yourself. <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna buy a ticket to Africa and I'm gonna wander. <laughs> You're gonna buy a ticket to die. Yeah. <laughs> That's great. It'd be so epic. That's what we do here in America. We just spend our money to die. You know, let me get a cigarette, let me get some alcohol, let me just die. That's true. I mean, that's literally what we do. Let me get some food die while I'm dying, too. You know what I mean? Yeah, we. that's true. All right. So we're veering away because what's more harmful than an elephant? <coughs> Other humans. Other humans are so dangerous to humans. Humans I mean, are the most dangerous creatures. If I was life. a dog and I Googled, are, you, <coughs> are humans dangerous? They'd it'd be extremely. like, stay the fuck away. Extremely. You, bite they're unpredictable. They yeah. yeah. If they corner you, fucking bite them. You yeah. Know, like, <laughs> yeah. Fuck yeah. Humans are the most dangerous creatures on the planet, dude. We were driving, like, putting everyone in danger, fucking hydroplaning on the highway. I know. With bald tires. That's just normal human behavior, you know? <laughs> it is, too. We had to go to the bank. Check this out. If we didn't go to the bank today, we would have hit overdraft fee. We can't afford that. 
So we have to fucking risk our lives and drive through the rain with bald tires. That's being poor. Yeah, that is being poor. That's ninety nine percent of us. Okay, yeah, ninety maybe. That's the nineties a better number. Nineties a better number because there's and plenty of middle class people yeah, out there that try to claim that's like not they're poor. poor, and those motherfuckers are ridiculous. I'm poor. You're not poor. But I think <laughs> it is crazy because humans are so scary that I would, I would never. I would you rather be in a dark alley with a random cat, dog, oh my owl, God. or a random human? Definitely any animal else. in the world. Anything Anyone. Else. Yeah, no, I'd rather be an elephant. That's a night, even in the yeah. daytime walking, and then someone gets behind you. I'm talking like about it's an alley. alley. There's yeah. There's nowhere, like, you either go that way or that way. That's I know, it. that's yeah. what I'm talking about. That's like a nightmare. A that's nightmare. ridiculous. Humans. They're I the used scariest to, people. When on I was the 10 or so, I used to live <laughs> in, in a alleyway? house. No, in a house, but right across the street, as in, think of like um, us to across to. You know, our neighbor's house right there. Okay? That's how... Yeah. Okay. There was a wall. And on the other side of the wall was an yeah, alley. Like full of hobos and like yeah. just crazy people. <laughs> yeah. Right there. And it was just a nightmare. Humans are so scary. scary. Yeah. I can't trust a single human humans like, are like that. Like, that's crazy. Like, humans are the only like creatures, like, on the planet that have, like, bad intentions. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? We want to blow you up, kill you, take your money, have sex with you. Something crazy. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, something bizarre. Kidnap you and sell you. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, like, literally, shit. like, it's... Lions don't kidnap each other. No. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> hey, I'll give you your lion cubs back for $20 million. Literally, though, <laughs> and it's just like, why, why are people, why? I don't know, man. It's bizarre. It's humans. We are the worst fucking creatures on the planet. And that's just so sad. You see, so yes, you know, I want to take my babies. You know, like oh, the babies that we're not making enough bullshit. We need less babies, less humans on this planet. I want to take I my feel. camera and go watch some wild animals. So that's how the conversation started. I said I want to go take pictures of things, and he said that's really dangerous. <laughs> and I'm like, yeah, I'm sure it is, but that's I would right. so much rather do that. But I literally than... just educated you. You were about to go die. You were about to go. No, because elephants. I'm educating you that <laughs> I want to go be around nature because my other idea was taking pictures of humans, you know? <laughs> In their natural habitat? No, no, like for like wedding photos and shit. Oh, hell like, no. Weddings? We don't believe in weddings. But, yeah, that's true. The, the, the cost or whatever the bullshit weddings represent. You know? Yes, I want to travel the world and take photos. Yes, that's fine. Cool normal human shit. I don't know how we'll get there, but we will. I'm going to start small, though. Like, I'm going to start fearing, or, like, standing on the car when the javelinas are out, so I can take pictures <laughs> like of I them. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like, I'm not going to be afraid of taking pictures, but I'm going to stand at a safe distance. Like, I'm not going to be dumb, you know? Where's that bear video? It's on my phone. My old phone. I'm still going to upload that. You never uploaded that? How would I do that? I... Th Really thought at one point we uploaded it. I never did. To your YouTube. It's not. You have like 400 videos, you're sure? I'm anyway, sure. I check my videos every day. We get bears here. So, yes, if we ever got another bear, I'd like get on the roof, you know, from the back window. <laughs> He'll climb up there. You really fucking think so? Fuck yeah, there's trees leaning right up against our house. Can you imagine if he climbed up there? You're stuck. <laughs> you fucking jump and hope you have a glider. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking glide down. But that's the thought. I want to take a picture of a bear. Like, not with the window separating me, you know? But not like a selfie picture. Like a professional camera photo of a bear eating trash. <laughs> like, that sounds... Like, Anna's house would be the perfect place to do that. Because even though she's out in the <coughs> open, she's still at like a... Or... <coughs> Uh, Fernando's house. Because he's across the street, so he's got that, <coughs> you know, view. But he can stand behind his gate. You know, there's just he's no good... our trash area? He yeah. can't stand behind his gate. It's dangerous. Bear hop right over that. Yeah, I know, but there... I... He can stand on his porch, right, with the door open. I'm just saying they both have such great views of our trash area. Yeah. And I not, don't. <laughs> we're, we're not the only people with trash, though. Yeah, but... I mean, that's true. But I didn't see the bear in her trash. I saw the bear in our trash, outside our window. It was awesome! It was the coolest mountain town thing that you would ever experience. Okay, for real. It's recording. like, well, I figured it would be. So imagine, like, going to, like, Mount Lemon, you know, when you see a bear. Like, that's the experience you want, you know? No. To see a bear in a mountain? No. no. 
fuck no. This is the most dangerous. Why do you want to be in danger? She's like, I want to jump out of an airplane. I want to pet an elephant. I want to what? Go see a bear up close? You're absolutely insane. You know that, right? Like, no. you want to get mangled? Okay, so everything that you're saying is obviously, like, common sense, but also... It goes back to us being animals. Like, we're not supposed but, to have doors and shit. Do you want to do anything safe? I just want to take pictures. I don't want to get close. I don't want to feed it. I get just... a telescope. No, I want to take pictures. A photographic telescope. I'm sure it's a thing. Why? A... Telescopes are for space. So you can see from far away. That, no. Those are binoculars. No. No. The world is flat, and you can see all the way across it. <laughs> he had to cover up that he was talking about the wrong thing. <laughs> the world's flat. You need to be able to see all the way across to the halfway point, which Imagine, is what, like 500 right? million miles? I don't know, right? <laughs> That'd be sick. It's got to be light years or something away. Yes, yeah, so I want to be slightly dangerous and take pictures of wild animals. That's not slightly dangerous. Don't dumb it down. It's fucking scary. I want to know what I was in my past life because all well, I you will when they mangle you. all I ever want to do is feel wild. You will, but then you get stuck in today's world and everything. And I you're suggest like, a nice blade, maybe a big gun. Okay, I'll take a freaking gun. <laughs> Which is crazy because you're gonna kill an animal. No, so you're right. No, you know I'll I mean? let them kill me because I'm in well, their habitat. Say, exactly, you're the one that deserves to be eaten. <laughs> I shouldn't be biased. I just should pretend I don't have a brain and let and die. Yeah, I, wa <laughs> I watched uh, the hippos attacking um, lions. You ever seen hippos attack lions? No, hippos <sighs> are scary. Oh my god, they just pick them up like they're kitty cats and sp splash them around in their mouth. It's so crazy. <laughs> a lion, you know what I mean? That thing weighs like a thousand pounds. No, it doesn't. Lions? It probably weighs like 80 or 90 you are, oh my goodness, you better Google something. No, you're probably right. Common probably sense right. is gone, guys. You hear it. I'm going to say. You hear it, 80 pounds. Our dog weighs more than that. Uh, yeah, good point. Oh my God. I'm going to say 300 pounds. Okay, yes, a young male lion, sure. Female, maybe. You're not going to Google it, huh? No, I'm not going to Google you trying to ask me to have a heart attack. My right phone's now? recording you content. No, well, why, my, my, uh, my little tablet. Your phone iPhone. <laughs> No, it? that's okay. It's charging, I think. I'll yeah. try and remember to look up a lion's weight later, but <laughs> people are gonna hear you and think that you are twelve years old. Yeah. <laughs> that's okay. That's why I'm here. To make sure you don't get mangled by I smoke and weed, alright? Well that's great. You Kids, thought I could use a telescope to take a picture of a bear from <laughs> I said a photographic telescope. <laughs> After the fact. <laughs> And I didn't say anything about taking a picture. I said to look at it. I don't no. know what you want to do. There's Discovery Channel's been around since I was a kid. Mm -mm. Watch the TV. I want to be one of those people that are filming those shows. Oh my god. I want to. Re I want to be. You a have to be trained. I really think so. I'm sure you do. You have to like not have beef jerky in the morning, so you don't smell like a fresh. <laughs> Can meat, you, you know imagine? I mean? right? Yeah. <laughs> you just chew it on a slim. You have like a steak breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> You're just breathing all heavy. Hilarious. <sighs> Hey, boy. <laughs> hey. <laughs> He's like. <sighs> yeah. You did your cat litter that morning and now you just <laughs> yeah. take <of> cats. <laughs> but that's interesting. I wonder if I could go to college for that. <laughs> I hope so. What would you What would you go for? Like zoology, huh? Not dying, yeah. The Not study of college. like animals. They should make a common sense college. They should. They really should. Just your common knowledge. Not not your stupid history and all the lies and shit. I'm talking <coughs> common sense. They should teach it. You know? And you know what they'll teach? What? Take pictures of elephants. <laughs> yeah. Also to shake your dick before you get done peeing. You know? Like, common sense things that kids don't know these days. Like, I see kids walking with driblets down their pants, and I'm like, you didn't shake it? Sometimes you have driblets on your yeah, pants. Yeah, but you gotta shake it. I'm old. <laughs> Us <laughs> ladies don't get driblets inside That's so brain. funny, yeah. Us guys, I don't know if it's All normal. you have to do is use toilet paper, so it's not like... On the, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, <laughs> I'm like... Weird. Well, yeah. Why, why don't you use toilet paper? What do you mean? There's nothing to wipe when I go pee. Well, if it drips, it's obviously going, like, down, right? I push straight into the toilet. Oh, that's right. I mean, if you don't point straight into the toilet, it doesn't go in the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you're really far away. <laughs> Try to do like a 10-foot pee stream. I would hate to be a man. No, it's great. We could pee anywhere. 
I know. Wiping. I'm like bleeding for seven days, and you're <laughs> like, I can be <pee> anywhere. <laughs> freely. I don't even I have could, to undo my belt. I could bleed you know? freely. I really feel like that's normal for guys, too. Like, my pants are never that tight. I can just fucking suck in and pull out, you know? <laughs> Literally, yeah, I gotta suck in my gut and pull it out. <laughs> Wouldn't it be cool if yeah. my phone captured it starting to snow? Oh like an God. entire transition. It'd be amazing. I should leave it out there all night long. <laughs> the <entire day. laughs> yeah, it'd it's be funny because I have to delete a thirty-second video to record thirty seconds, I and know. you can leave that all fucking night. Probably. <laughs> That's bizarre. I probably could. Just turn it on live right now. Let it go. I should. Yeah, right. No, a lot of people do it. They just no. Do I live know. Yeah, I figured. Beautiful. People will watch. I it. want evergreen content. That no one's gonna go to my live and find it. You know. That's true. That's true. Depends on the hashtags, whether it pops up or not. <gasps> you gotta make that description real pretty. Man, now I'm thinking, like, maybe I should leave it out there for a while. I just gotta check on it, make sure it's okay. I can always cut down an hour of it to upload. I can only upload 40 minutes. Yeah, you can definitely cut it all day footage 40 minutes. Because I like how it gets this, those fast bursts and stuff. Like that. There's nothing outside right now. What? It's not raining right now. Yes, it is. Is it? Yeah. It might be like slightly drizzling, but I'm looking out here. I don't see nothing. I'm recording nothing? All right, guys. No. Peace out. <laughs> On that note, we thank you. Peace. <laughs>